What is going on guys, George here, and today we are back in Revhead. Um, the last video I did on here, we had this special edition Whaley car, supercharged, ready to roll, ready to burn rubber, ready to smoke them when you need them. But today we're going to take the supercharger off. What? Well, I had a comment. Um, let's see, I have to find it. Um, I'm really terrible at this. I should have it. While I'm looking for the comment, we're going to go ahead and put this up on the lift. Uh, notifications. Um, let's see. Uh, when I did the V6, um, the V6, uh, Joshua James said you should put the L6 engine in it, which is the inline six, which should be a lot stronger. Because if you ever seen the inline six in a Jeep, they're really strong. Um, so we're going to do that. Um, and then let's see. I'm trying to find it. Let's see. Let's see. Somebody said that I should make. Oh, Cat Attack said. Uh, Cat Attack said, do a ricer. So basically, we're gonna put an inline six. We're gonna put the full drive, but make it a front wheel drive. We're gonna put some the biggest kind of race tire stuff I could find, and we're gonna do that ten mile attempt, ten mile. 10 lap race. So let's go ahead and remove this. Well, we're not going to do the race in this video because I don't want the video to be too, too long. Because, I mean, you know, videos get pretty long when you're doing all that. So we're going to do, uh, we're going to build the car and then we'll race it in a different video. So let's go here and see if we can find. We want to. Let's see. L4. We want an L6. I know the car. We need to buy one of these uh, Wayne Jug cars because they come with that motor in it. But there's one that's wrecked for freaking $12,000. I mean, $12,000. But if we get it, let's see. Alright, so I just bought the car. We are going to go. Uh, we'll do a different paint job on it. We'll, we'll make our uh, limited edition a crazy looking car. So let's go. Alright, so we got this car. It looks like the taxi. We can do a taxi build. The supercharged taxi. Um, but we're going to grab this and put the L7, uh, L6 in. I'm hoping we can fit the L6. Look, that car has less miles than my... I swear I'm going to find a car one day that has more miles than my Challenger. So it makes me feel better. Alright, so we have the yellow taxi. You know, actually those rams right there is the ones I was actually wanting to put on my car. So I think we actually might take these rims off too. It's like, yo, you need those rims? Because I do. <laughs> Alright, so let's go ahead and take the rims off because I need those. We have the street tires, so we'll have like the kind of tires that I'm, I'm wanting. We might put drag tires on. I don't know. It just depends on how good it hooks up. Alright, let's remove that. Um... Is the the motor is in good condition? I bet it starts too. All right, so let's go ahead and take this motor. It has 174 horsepower. Should be good in that little car. Uh, so what kind of transmission? That's a three speed. I like to have a four speed. Um, I think this is all we need. But I'm not going to get rid of this car. I think we might actually use it and build like a like a a taxi. Kind of like a taxi supercharged car. So let's go ahead and go back. Let's see. Let's see if we can find. Um, I just forgot what I was going to say. Oh dear lord. Uh, hmm. I was going to say something. I, I, oh, four wheel drive. We need to find a four wheel drive. Differential, four speed. Um, we need to find a. Let's see, four speed gearbox, use differential. Uh, we need to find a new four wheel drive differential for the Wangja. What if I can use that four wheel drive? Let's try that. Alright, so let's go back to there and get our other car. Alright, let's grab this one. Alright, so let's go ahead and jack this sucker up. 
And I did get a comment saying a uh, child around a car without a radiator and see what happens. I think what we're going to do is in one video, I will start taking parts off and see how the car... See how the car will run without certain parts and see if it'll end up just breaking down and dying. Of course, the radiator, you know it's going to overheat. But, I mean, we might as well give it a try. Alright, let's put this L6 in. Oh, it can't be installed. What? No. Is this the, I bet that other car is the only car we can install it on. Dang. So we are going to have to put like a regular little V6 in it. Well, that sucks. And the drive belt's crap on it. <laughs> Alright, so let's put a transmission in. Dang, I was really wanting to do that. Alright, let's find out this drive belt. Uh, so let's go ahead and fix it. The drive belt, 80%. It's, do I still hear it squeaking? Ah, screw it, 80%. Let's see how far the car will make it like that. So let's go ahead and remove the rear. <laughs> remove the rear. Um, put air four-wheel drive in. Put our dry shaft. It's a dry shaft in, yeah? Okay, let's see. i got to remove it from this. I keep forgetting that. Differential box. Uh, let's see we can remove. Remove. It's cool because I can use all this for the other. Um... Let's see, just put this in. Air front wheel drive rice mobile. Not really rice, I don't know. I, I guess it, it, it would be once. That's the kind of, that's what we're going for. We're going for like a, I have no clue. <laughs> I wish we had lower suspension though. All right, so let's go ahead and take these tires off. I actually like these rims. Um, and put the bigger ones on. The 2.45. There is a little bit of a difference right there. I, these rims are kind of like the old school, like I guess like they're stilly rims where they're like, if you ever know, you can look at like a lot of vehicles that came back in the day with like the 16 or 15 inch old school stillies, like you could like on the square body Chevys and stuff. You can actually get them into like 22s and 24 inch. Steelies now, which I think is kind of cool. It adds that look to it. It's like still the old school look, but you got the big tires. You got still got that, you know, a decent sized rim. I actually have a, a first gen Dodge Ram. It's a 92. I'm wanting to find some uh, like 20s uh, inch Steelies, kind of like this for them. Gives it that old school look. All right, so look at that. It's a front wheel drive car. Um, let's see. We need to. Put a crazy looking paint job on it because that's the first thing. Uh, hmm. Let's see. Let's do it that. And we need some decals. Don't like Reichers have a bunch of decals on them. Uh, let's see. Let's take this one off. I guess we could do something like that. And let's do like a, a blue. Uh, I don't know. Let's do... How about yellow? That looks pretty good. That guy looks like the daggone uh, uh, <laughs> Mr. Shamp Scooby-Doo. Alright. We've got gas. We've got that. Let's do an oil change. The water's good. Let's give this thing a wash and fix the dents. The battery's charged. Let's take it out and see if it'll rip and maybe we can find somebody to race. Alright. Car does not sound too good. Let's rock and roll. Remember, we don't have a supercharger or anything like that on it. It's just a regular car. We do need to put those sway bars on that I talked about in the last video. All right. Is there any, is that guy here to race? I don't think he is. Dang on! I was trying to find somebody to race. Let's see. Um, let's go out to set away because usually there's somebody sitting over here. 
their car is um, slowly falling apart. <laughs> Look at tucking the wheels. Tucking the wheels. Alright, so um, are we overheating already? <laughs> we are overheating. Okay, great. Alright, so um, let's go ahead and downshift them. Apparently these V6s like die really really quick. Hey, is there some way out here? It looks like there's some way out here. <laughs> I don't know who you are, but I'm gonna race you with a blown radiator. Yep, we are running we are running pretty hot. Come on. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I think we're slowly making it. I've lost a lot of races because the vehicle just sucks. What is this? What's this guy doing? What is this? Do I stop? I mean... Okay, apparently he's just... Maybe he's like trying to find some... I have no clue. Okay, well, I guess we're not going to find anybody to race, but... We are ready for the 10 lap race after I replace the radiator and probably everything in the motor. Well, we're going to go ahead and get a little selfie here. Alright, so let's drive back to the garage and see if the motor is damaged in any sort of way. We'll probably end up blowing it up before we get there. <clears throat> yeah, these V6s don't last too long, so 10 laps is going to take a heck of a toll. And you know this car isn't that heavy either. But we need to put our um, heavy duty sway bars on. I know we need to do that so it doesn't lean like that because Lord, this car is leaning. LEANING! <laughs> Got that shoulder lean. That's old school. Alright, uh oh. Oh no! There we go. Go, go, go. Turn. No! There we go. Alright. Let's jack it up and see what's going on. Uh, let's see. Radiator. It's good. The coolant fan. 77%. I don't know why. But I bet this motor is like completely toast. No, it's, it's still good actually. Um, let's see. Let's put stronger bars on it. Let's remove these. I think I've got the back one. No, I don't. I have the front one. I have a, I think if the front might be 20, is the front 25 millimeter too? I have a 50, I think I have a 53 millimeter actually. I do, so it's a stronger sway bar. It's bad, but <laughs> it works. See if we can find any sway bars in it. Suspension, um, New factory rear suspension. I don't need that. Let's see. We want a rear sway bar hard. That's what I'm wanting. And do they have a front one since theirs is bad? No, they just have. It doesn't say. I think it's just stock ones. Uh, racing brakes. Let's use racing brakes. I want new racing brakes. New brakes. New racing brakes for an auto. I guess we can't use racing brakes for a thousand dollars. They better stop you real quick. Oops, let's see. Um, oh, we gotta remove every one of them and put the daggone brakes on. Daggone! I hope it's like some kind of cool looking rotor. Sport rear brake remove. Let's put them rear racing brakes. Well, they're red. That, that's that's uh, a thing, isn't it? <laughs> uh, let's see, this is it. This is my tire. All right, let's put them rear. I mean, front. Why do you say rear? Uh, we'll switch it with sport racing brakes with sport brakes with racing brakes. Oh my God, I can't talk. Huh? What if we have a powerful car and we only have front brakes? We can do a good burnout. Hmm, that is something to think about. All right, let's go to the other side. To the other side. Moving on to the other side. 
All right, so let's remove the sport brake and put them racing brakes, bro. Racing brakes install and restall install my two forty five twenty. Yeah, <laughs> back to this size. Figures we have four. Even takes long time replacing brakes in a game, more or less in real life. All right, racing rear. Red brakes. Put a new tire. We'll put my tire on. Put my tire. Okay, I think we should do a V6. I mean, a race uh, supercharger on this though, because I feel like we didn't have enough power. Do we have one? We don't have one because we will have to put one on. That is a thing we'll have to do. Let's see. Starter fix. I like how a lot of this you can just go in and just like fix it. Uh, thermostat. Let's go ahead and fix that. Um, sparks. We can fix that. Water pump. Fix it. Oh, we can't do that. We can do like an oil change. Um, let's see. What? Do we buy anything else for it? Oh, yeah. The rear sway bar. Duh. Alright. So let's go ahead and take that one off and see what millimeter. That's a 25 millimeter. What's your racing one? 40. So it, it should be a little bit stiffer. So it should do a little bit better. Um. Your speedometers <laughs> are completely wore out. Um, let's see. I think we're good though. I think I think we're decent. Um, let's take it out and try. I know we don't have an air filter, and it'll probably make it bad. I have no clue. Probably make it run a little bit bad. Go go go! I feel like I'm driving like the Scooby Doo mobile, like the mystery machine. There we go. Okay, it doesn't. Well, it does seem like it's still like wavy, but hopefully it holds it, it holds the track pretty good. Maybe we can find some like racing, like racing uh, uh, break um. Uh, Racing sway bars. I cannot think. Uh oh. I was like, Flip. oh god, no. I seriously thought I could dodge that. Golly, look, we're running on the wall. Are we sitting here pegging off the red limit? Okay, apparently we kind of crushed that. Not our car. Not the race mobile. Um, let's go ahead and fix $400 damage. Let's give it an oil change because, you know, we need to. Um. Give it a wash. Fix that battery. The tires are good. Alright guys. In the next video we will take this on a lap. I will try to find a supercharger before we go. Um, but we will take it. And that's a pretty color actually. That purple. But we will take it and do the 10 lap race. Because I need to win that. Because we need the money. We're $50,000. We need money. Anyways guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Hit that like button. Punch that subscribe button. And as always this is George. And uh, I'm out of here.